Hi guys, welcome back to Energy TC today. As we are welcome back to Energy TT, and I remember when I say Energy T last time, I am the creator of Energy T. Energy T. Energy T. And that's what I Okay, now what's that about? Hi guys, welcome back to Energy TT, and today we'll be talking about the energy value chain. A value chain is a chain of activities that processes raw material through a number of intermediate stages to a marketable end product. Natural gas after production must pass through a value chain of activities that add value to the original material such that it is more readily usable by the final consumer. Broadly speaking, the natural gas value chain can be divided into the upstream, midstream and downstream. The upstream deals with exploration, production and compression. The companies involved in the upstream include BP, Shell, EOG and quite recently the Nobu. The midstream deals with transportation, distribution, marketing and processing. The two companies involved in the midstream include PPGPL, which is Phoenix Park, Gas Processors Limited, and the National Gas Company of Trinidad and Tobago, or NGC. Downstream. Downstream deals with utilization, conversion, and shipping. The energy value chain adds value to the country in two ways, economic or monetary value in that it brings in money to the government and foreign investors, as well as social value in the form of creating jobs and improving communities. Okay guys, that has been our quick facts video today. Thanks for paying attention, listening. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and follow Energy CT on all social media platforms. Thank you.